Did your Instagram account get hacked and you can't get back in because a hacker is controlling it? Don't worry, it's not the end of the world. I'm gonna help you get right back into your account. There's two parts to recovering your account. One is a selfie verification process and the second part is securing your account and kicking the hacker out for good. Now, I'm gonna walk you through exactly what to do step by step. Okay, now first let me explain what the hacker has done to your account. He has set up two-step authentication in your account using his phone, meaning his phone is creating codes, backup codes that allows him to get back into your account even if you change the password. Also, he has connected his Facebook account to your Instagram account. These are two backup methods he's going to use to get back into your account and try to stop you from recovering your account. Now, I'm going to tell you about the setup you need in order to complete this process successfully. The first thing you need to do is to watch this entire video until the end and possibly multiple times so you know what you do because you're going to be in a race with the hacker to secure your account once you have been confirmed. First of all, you need some time on your hands. You don't want to be in a rush while doing this. Secondly, you need a separate laptop. You need this laptop to read the email verification codes off because you can never X out of the Instagram app. The second you X out of the Instagram application, you are starting over again the entire process. So don't X out of the Instagram application. Now, let's dive straight into part one, which is creating the video selfie verification. So you're gonna go to your phone, you're gonna go to your Instagram app, you're gonna click your profile picture in the bottom right hand corner, click hold it for a short second, a little menu is going to pop up and you're going to click login or create new account. Now you're going to click login to existing account. Then you're going to enter your username. Then you're going to click forgot password. Then you're going to click need more help, not the next button. Now you're going to arrive at choose a way to recover your account page. And here, you're gonna have a couple of options. Hopefully your phone number or your email, and maybe the hacker's phone and email. Don't choose the hacker's phone or email. Um, so if you have your phone number there, that's the best option. You're gonna choose that, and then you're gonna go on and hit next. On the next page, you're gonna have enter security code. This is where you're gonna enter the security code you received from the text message. You're just gonna plot that right in there without exiting the app. After you enter the security code you got from your phone number, you're gonna arrive at another enter security code page. And this is where the hacker set up your two-step authentication codes. So you're gonna have to go to the bottom under confirm and click try another way. After that, you're gonna be faced with a small pop-up menu and at that point, you're gonna select get support. On the next screen, you're gonna have a couple of options. On this page, you're gonna select my account was hacked. On the next page, you're gonna have two options. You're gonna select, yes, I have a photo of myself in my account, even if you don't have a photo of yourself in your account. If you don't have a photo of yourself in your account, this might be really hard. On the next screen, Instagram is going to ask you, how can we reach you? Uh, here you need to enter an email that you can access on your laptop and on your phone. You will find out later why. So you're going to enter that email and instantly you're going to receive an email with a new verification code. So now you need to be prepared. Uh, you are going to input the verification code you received in that email and you're gonna hit confirm. But as soon as you hit confirm, you need to be ready to do the video selfie verification because it's gonna start the second you hit confirm. So you're gonna hold your phone up in front of you, kind of like this, like a foot and a half away from it. The lighting needs to be good. You need to remove anything that might be covering your face. And then you're gonna read the code off the email on your laptop. You're gonna plot it in like this and then hit confirm. And then immediately Instagram is gonna snap a picture of you and you're gonna follow the directions they're giving you with moving your head around. And then once it's done, it's gonna say complete it and you're gonna hit submit. Now, after submitting, almost immediately, you're gonna receive an email that says, we received your request. 
Thanks for submitting your selfie video. We received this information and it's pending review. You can expect to hear from us within one business day. Thanks, the Instagram team. Now you just have to wait. Either you're gonna receive an email that says, your information couldn't be confirmed. We weren't able to confirm your identity from the video you submitted. You can submit a new video and we'll review it again. There's a learn more link, thanks the Instagram team. Now I received this plenty of times before I got the email I really wanted and which is what you want, which is a golden ticket to get back into your Instagram account. And that email reads, your information is confirmed. We successfully reviewed your information to confirm that it's you, so you're now able to get back into your account. We recommend resetting your password in order to secure your account. Follow these steps. One, select reset password link below to enter your new password. Three, select backup codes link instead of entering a six digit code. Enter this eight digit security code to log back in. And then there's the code. Now this is all good, but there's many other steps you need to take in order to prevent your hacker from kicking you right back out once you do this. Now this takes me to the second part, securing your account and kicking the hacker out for good. You're gonna open the confirmed email on your phone and on the laptop. On the laptop, you're also gonna open a browser window with the URL instagram.com. Also, you're gonna create a password in your notes. You're gonna copy that password. Then you're gonna go back to your email application on your phone. You're gonna hit that reset password link in the confirmation email. This is gonna open up Instagram with a reset your password page. Now you're gonna paste your new password twice and then hit reset password. You are not logged into your account at this point and you need to immediately log into your account. So you're gonna hit your profile picture in the bottom right hand corner. You're gonna click login or create new account. You're gonna click login to existing account. You're gonna enter your username and paste the password you just created and then hit login. Now you're gonna be hit with another enter a six digit security code. Now this is really important. At the bottom of this screen, below the confirm button, there's gonna be the link try another way this time you're gonna hit use backup code and now you're gonna enter the eight digit security code you received in the email and you need to read this code off your laptop so you're gonna read it off your laptop enter it in and then you're gonna hit confirm now you're actually in your account and you need to move with the speed of lightning you need to go instantly to your profile picture and then the menu at the top right corner, the three bars, hit that. Then you're gonna hit settings. Then you're gonna hit security. Then you're gonna hit two-factor authentication. Then you're gonna hit that authentication app recommended. Now at the bottom of the screen, there's gonna say original device with three dots next to it. Hit those three dots, click remove, then go back Make sure two-factor authentication is off. Then you're gonna go back and back again. You're gonna scroll down just a little bit, hit account, then at the very top, hit personal information. Then you're gonna change the phone number to your phone number. Confirm it via a text message that you're gonna receive. If your email is still there, is there because Instagram probably put it there, confirm that email. Then you're gonna go back out and then you're gonna go down to security again. You're gonna go into two-factor authentication. You're gonna turn on two-factor authentication using your phone number. And at this point, congratulations, you have probably prevented your hacker from re-entering your Instagram account, but he can still recover it, which takes me to the final part of this process, which is where you need your laptop and the browser window. So go onto your laptop in a browser window, log into Instagram.com with your username, your new password, and your two-factor authentication that you set up using your own phone number. So you're gonna log in there and then hit your profile picture, click settings, and on the next page, you're gonna scroll down at the left side under the meta logo is gonna be a light blue link called account center hit that link. This is gonna open up a new window. And here you're gonna see an overview of all the Facebook accounts that are linked to your Instagram account. 
and you're probably going to see your hacker's Facebook account. So you need to remove that and remove all the other accounts and even your own. You can add it back later on. So after you removed all the accounts, you need to go to Facebook and you need to change your Facebook password as well. And you should probably put on two-factor authentication in Facebook. Now, congratulations, my friend. You successfully recovered your account. Now it's time to do some damage control. Check to see if maybe the hacker might have hacked someone else and get in touch with them outside of Instagram to possibly help them recover their account as well. You can also let your friends know that you were hacked and not to fall for anything. Um, in my case, the hacker had probably DM like 2,000 people and I spent probably the whole night trying to unsend messages, tell people I was hacked, and make sure that everything was as it was supposed to be in my account. Side note here, if when you click need more help, the Instagram help page opens up instead of the choose your recovery method page, then you need to empty the cache of your Instagram app. Two ways of doing this, either just X out of the app and then try again, or you can, if this still doesn't work, you can go to your iPhone settings, general iPhone storage, scroll down to the Instagram app, go into the Instagram app, click offload app, wait until it has offloaded and then reinstall app. Then go back to your Instagram app and do the same process over again. So if you found this video helpful, uh, please give it a like and share it with someone who might be hacked out of their account. And if you're still logged out after watching this video, I might be able to help you out. You can leave a comment in the comment section below and I'll get back to you.